You mentioned Bucks um, first of two in a row in Milwaukee. There's a day off in between them. Um, a week ago today, they put uh, they put a beat down on the Bucks in Cleveland. They won by 40. Giannis didn't play. What do you expect from the Bucks with uh, an interim coach? And we'll get into who's going to replace him. But what do you expect from the Bucks in this game tonight, Wednesday? Well, it's going to be one of two things. They're either going to be so exhausted from all the news that they fired Adrian Griffin and uh, are going to have Doc Rivers leave the broadcast booth to come coach him or, and, and tonight have an interim coach. You know, so it could it could work against Milwaukee in a lot of ways. Sometimes, however, you know, these players remember the 40 point beat down last week in Cleveland without Giannis. And now they've got a coaching change. Maybe they're refreshed. So, you know, sometimes these situations can work against a team such as Cleveland that's on the road. Everybody's fired up. Uh, the players who were kind of behind the firing of Adrian Griffin in Milwaukee could feel recharged now that he's no longer there. And the Bucks are already pretty good as is. They're 30 and 13. So, uh, you know, like I said, the Cavs could probably go in there and steal one. I think if they get one of these next two, it would be tonight. But, uh, you know, they also have a lot of things working against them because it's, it's almost like the start of a new season for Milwaukee.